Today we will learn about tally audit. Audit is an important function of any business organization. It denotes that the business has true and fair transactions during the year. Tally Prime has an inbuilt feature, Tally Audit, which enables the auditor to perform an audit or track changes that affect the integrity of a transaction, such as changes made to rate ledger masters and amounts in the voucher are reflected in the tally audit listings enable tally audit features you have to enable the security controls tally audit feature while creating a company you can use the administrator login id or create a user with tally audit access by selecting audit listings in respective security levels you need to go to the gateway of tally press alt plus k then select alter in the company alteration screen set enable tally audit features to yes please note the user should enable control user access to company data Create an auditor's login ID and password before enabling the tally audit or use the administrator's login ID for the purpose of tally audit. The auditor or administrator can display or print the tally audit listing and verify the transactions made. In case the auditor or administrator is satisfied with the authenticity of the transaction, or the changes made, he will accept all or selective transactions by clicking the relevant button. Once the transactions are accepted, they are removed from the audit listing and will not be displayed again. To display the tally audit statistics for voucher types, you need to go to the gateway of tally, select display more reports. Select Statement of Accounts, select Tally Audit, then select Voucher Types. The Audit Statistics screen showing the audit statistics based on voucher types is displayed, where the entered and altered vouchers count are displayed in columnar format. Set show voucher type having no entries to yes to display all the voucher types having no unaccepted entries. Set show count of modified, cancelled and deleted vouchers to yes to display the modified, cancelled and deleted vouchers count in columnar format. Set sort by default voucher to yes to display the list of voucher types based on the alphabetical order of parent voucher types. Press F2 to change the selected period. Press F8. It will give the list of altered voucher that are made today. It is very helpful to see all the changes that are done by the user for any voucher type on that particular day. This report is based on the system date for the altered vouchers, irrespective of the voucher date. The today's changes screen appears as shown. Press Ctrl plus B and select the required user action on transactions from the list. Altered. This option allows you to view and audit all the audited altered vouchers consisting of all modified, cancelled and deleted vouchers. Cancelled. This option allows you to view and audit only the audited cancelled vouchers. Deleted. This option allows you to view and audit only the audited deleted vouchers. Modified. 
This option allows you to view and audit only the modified vouchers where date, amount, ledger masters are being altered in the audited vouchers. Please note, when altered and modified, user action on transactions are selected. It allows the user to configure using F12 all the options like show billwise details, show inventory details, show descriptions for stock items, show mode of payment, show additional bank details and show cost center details as compared to cancelled and deleted user action on transactions. For cancelled vouchers, the user can enter the reason for cancellation in narration field which can be displayed when the option show narrations also is set to yes in configuration. Press F2 to change the current date or default system date of the report. For displaying all the altered vouchers for the respective day. Please note when F2 is pressed by default the system date is displayed as current date. Press Alt plus F8 for displaying the first thousand vouchers of the company for auditing irrespective of voucher types and user wise. On verification of the transactions, the administrator or auditor press Alt plus R to accept each transaction one by one or press Alt plus S to accept all the transactions. On acceptance of the transactions by the administrator or auditor, the transactions will be removed from the tally audit listing. Alternatively, the administrator or auditor can take a hard copy of the tally audit listing, verify the transactions manually and accept them. Tally audit monthly register. When drilled down from the vouchers types column, tally audit monthly register will be shown as in the screen. In configuration section, Set the option show count of modified, cancelled and deleted vouchers to yes to display the modified, cancelled and deleted vouchers count in columnar format as shown in the screen. Please note this configuration option will appear only if drilled down from the type of vouchers column whereas the same will not be available if drilled down from entered, modified, cancelled, deleted and altered column. Set periodicity as required based on selected periodicity data will be shown. To filter the selected list of entered or altered voucher type for a particular voucher type, click F4 and select the required voucher type as shown. Press F6 to view the monthly summary of tally audit monthly register. Press Alt plus F6 to view the quarterly summary of tally audit monthly register. Press Ctrl plus F6 to view the daily summary of tally audit monthly register. When drilled down from the tally audit monthly register for a specific month quarter or day, tally audit listing will be displayed for the respective voucher type. You can display the details of a report in different views with additional details or for a specific period. You can also view other reports related to the current report. To display the tally audit statistics for masters, you need to go to the gateway of tally Select Display More Reports. Select Statement of Accounts. Select Tally Audit. Then select Masters. The Audit Statistics screen showing 
the audit statistics for masters is displayed in the screen please note currently only leisure masters are available under the head accounting masters tally audit listing when drill down from the master wise report name column it will display the tally audit listing for the list of entered ledgers when drill down from the master wise report entered column then list of entered ledgers will be displayed as shown when drill down from the master wise report altered column the list of altered ledgers will be displayed as shown changes made to the ledger name or their opening balances or newly created ledgers since the last audit are displayed in the list of new or entered ledgers in case the ledger names are interchanged the auditor can identify this by comparing the ledger id assigned to the each ledger and comparing them to an earlier hard copy of the audit listings to display the tally audit statistics for users you need to go to the gateway of tally select display more reports select statement of accounts select tally audit then select users the audit statistics screen showing the audit statistics for users is displayed as shown along with username user type is also shown the total count of entered and altered for a particular user includes the count of masters and vouchers user statistics when drill down from the user wise audit statistics for a particular user it will displays the accounting masters and type of vouchers as shown when drill down from the user wise audit statistics the reports will be displayed as accounting masters this section displays the list of entered or list of altered ledgers or both type of vouchers this section displays the list of entered or list of altered vouchers or both when drill down from the type of voucher section tally audit monthly register will be displayed please note above reports can be configured to display the cancelled and delete count separately in columnar format thanks for watching please do comment what you want to see in my next topic please share my videos with your nearest one and don't forget to subscribe my channel to get the regular updates you can click on the info card to watch my previous videos or you can click on the playlist from info card to know elaborately